You see, I've come to understand that we live in a world filled with people who are deeply concerned about spiritual issues. The problem is they come to us looking for God and we give them the church. Dave's heard me say this before. They come to us looking for some way to make some sense out of the chaos in their lives. We give them a list of committees they can join when they walk in the door. They come to us looking for some kind of deep, genuine, transformative community experience. And we give them a pledge card or a time and talent survey or a spiritual gifts inventory so that they can serve us, the church. Too often it seems those spiritual but not religious find themselves encountering the church as a place which might best be described as religious but not spiritual. That is, I think, the challenge for our day, to be a vital, small church. Today means to engage the world as it is, not as it once was, not as we wish it could be, but as it really is. It means that we're going to have to do things differently than we did in the past. It's going to mean that we have to, do, we have to develop different understanding of leadership that we did in the past. Not just because we can't afford the old model, but because the old model doesn't <coughs> work anymore. What does it mean to be the church? What does it mean to be the church in Boston this week? Yeah, exactly. What does it mean to be the church in West Texas this week? What does it mean to be the church in Rancho Santa Margarita this week? That's a little bit about what we're going to be talking about in the next hour. Okay. Thanks. <laughs>